Hello everybody, I am the Bering Goat and welcome to the second 2017 bi-weekly. How do I never like keep track of this shit? I really don't know. It's, it's kind of annoying. Two main topics today, the DSO voting from last time and some important stuff with season two of the Battle Boss Reborn Cup. First, what we got done, of course, because that's how we always do it. Not a lot of robotic videos done. I did Robot Wars Reborn 20, and I think I did 19 in this period as well. Only those two videos. I did do a lot of other videos. There is a Minecraft series with four episodes ready to start probably next Monday, I'm thinking. And I also did one of those uh, Mario Kart videos that I filmed with Cole and Sam. We can't post that till May because of what Cole wants with it. It's okay. Trust me, it's, I think it's gonna be funny. I think you guys will like that. Six done, maybe seven videos done during this bi-week. It was really good. Also finished all the graphics, I believe, for the cup. Um, we'll get to the, that in a second, but that's just another huge step for the cup. A uh, little bit more to record, and then I should be I should be good to go for the editing stage. Now, first main topic, DSO voting. I mean, we're gonna knock out this bi-weekly quick, hopefully. I asked you guys if I should get a mod for DSL 2.2 that decreased the difficulty of the bots, made it more realistic and a little bit easier to fight, made it less OP. It was unanimous. I, I've checked it a couple different times and it was legit. One-sided, no votes for keeping it the way it was. So I went ahead and got that mod, installed, downloaded it, tested it. Seems like it's going fine. Well, kind of. Let me show you when I was just kind of free playing. The, this weird glitch that happened twice to me. So yeah, in the first clip you saw, you see me as Carbide running around with no opponent because Big Dog, whatever his new name was, Bad Dog I think it was, he glitched out of the arena, he was gone. I was hitting him, all of a sudden he disappeared, so I thought, oh, okay, Fuso Dog, I'll go find him. He was nowhere. And then the second one, it happened to me. It was the weirdest thing. Um, DSO isn't running the best. The four bot fights still lag a lot, so I'm probably going to disable that before I start the recording. And you see glitches like that happening, so there are issues with it still. But right now we've delayed it too much. I think it's time to start recording realistically, so I'm going to start working on that in these two weeks. Hopefully get a couple videos ready to go. I don't know if they'll appear next week, two weeks, three weeks from now, but know that it's going to start. Okay, and now for BattleBots Reborn Cup Season 2. We've been talking about it a lot recently, all the filming's done for it, there's a lot of the graphics I mentioned earlier that I got done, um, it's really coming along and I'm really getting excited because early summer is still realistically possible. There are a few concerns with it though, in fact I'm going to show you the main concern is with the studio shots that Cole and I did, I'll show you a little section and I'll mute the, mute the audio so that there are no spoilers or fights or anything, and I just want to, I want you guys to take a look at this. So yeah, I know that might have been hard to see a lot of stuff in there, but the main point I wanted you to see was the horrible focusing of the camera. My phone was used for this one, and we didn't really have enough time to constantly check the videos and see if they were doing well or not. Once we had it set up, it was like, okay, hit record, film, stop, do it again, get the next bit of footage. It. I mean, you can see there's all kinds of problems with that. I don't, I, it didn't seem like it was a lighting issue, because whether the light was on or off, it still struggled to focus. I even think it might have done this when the three of us filmed those Mario Kart videos. You can see it's a huge problem right now that I'm forced to work with, because Cole's gone to school, and I'm, gone to, I'm, gone, I'm at school as well, so we can't refilm. There's no time, there's no way we can do the refilming, and then the only other option is, well, delay the cup redo it during the summer. I, that's not going to work with me. I told you guys early summer for this thing, and I'm going to make early summer happen. So, unfortunately, we're going to have blurry clips, and I'll find a way to make a joke around that, but that's just a heads up right now. It's going to be blurry as fuck, it's going to be annoying as fuck, and it's going to constantly be in and out of focus. I can try and cover it with some graphics here and there, but you're still going to have to see it a little bit. And I apologize for the inconvenience. I apologize for this whole thing kind of getting rushed and not done properly because season one had a lot of things not done properly and I kept saying yeah season two is gonna be better we're gonna do this 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 and we're gonna do so many better things and while we improved in some areas it seems like we then let some of the good things slip down a little bit so focusing on weaknesses led to a weakness in the strengths so that was really the main worry and then the other two are just questions the first is music for fights so obviously we've got some of the music scores 
or Comedy Central battle bots that I used in season one that we use in the rematches, stuff like that. Now, the question I have for you guys is should we go with a more modern approach, how ABC does it, without any fight music? Just have it, you know, straight fight sounds, crowd sounds from the game, or would you guys like to have the music in it? Since I seem to like straw polls now, let's have a straw poll for that, because why the fuck not, right? I don't know which one I prefer, honestly. I feel like both would be made to work just as well. The music can be a bit distracting, I feel like. If I don't do the audio levels right, it might not come out well. However, it does fill in gaps. So like if there's a period where Cole and I are not commentating, it kind of does fill in the gap nicely. So I'll leave that guys up to you. Whatever gets highest most wins. Another major point, the posting schedule. The reason I bring this up is because a slight change to this was made. If you remember last time, the bracket draw came out, I did that on my own. We had the bracket set up and then there was a long wait till the first episode and then bang, we got going with Cole and we got all that stuff done. Did one different thing this year, based on how many fights there were and how many fights I'm doing an episode, it's gonna be four by the way, I made the bracket draw kind of the first episode and that first episode actually has one fight in it. And I filmed that with Cole, it was kind of just, it was a way to make one extra video, I guess, that felt like the cup, whereas last time the bracket draw just felt like a random video, it really just didn't, it never really uh, gelled well with the rest of it. So, this, the reason I ask about posting this is because I told you guys that the 40th episode of BattleBots Reborn I think is the end of March, like the 28th or something like that, and I told you guys and the bracket draw would happen in the BattleBots Reborn slot two weeks after uh, episode 40, so instead of 41 we would show the bracket draw. Um, I also then told you guys the cup would start early May. So yeah, there's obviously a little bit of a time gap in there. It would basically be early April, the bracket draw, and then technically the first fight, and then it would be like, I don't know, mid-May let's say, so about a month and a half, when then the next episode comes out. So my question to you is do you want that gap? Wow, thanks voice. Do you want that gap or would you rather me take the bracket draw video, I could bring it back with the other ones, and then from March 28th to whenever in May I'm planning on starting it, it can just be like that. Um, maybe we won't post BattleBots Reborn for like a month or so, or we do post it and then some people get confused when BattleBots Reborn 41 and 42 have heavyweights that then aren't in the cup. What better way to decide than a straw pull? So there's gonna be two straw pulls, there's gonna be one for music for fights, and then there's gonna be a second one for how to post it. I'll throw in some random dates to give you an idea of what I'm, uh, what I'm trying to describe here, and I'll let you guys decide that. Final thing for the cup, if you haven't seen the bi-weekly where I talked about making fan commercials, um, I'll link it in the description and then make sure you watch it as well. Basically, to make it feel more like the show, we're gonna add in commercials from you guys where obviously there's no payment involved. This is just a chance for you to promote anything you want on your channel, anything you guys do, 30 seconds or less. I mean, all, all the stipulations are in the other video. I'll link that, I'm not gonna repeat them. But yeah, if you guys wanna make a commercial to have in the BattleBots Reborn Cup and hopefully get some promotion and some uh, attention from other people, this is your chance and you got some time to do it. A few more weeks, I don't know. Let's, have, let's try and get it done by a month because I'm ready to get this thing edited. That is all for today. Next time, we will talk about these straw poll results. All right, I think that's it. Uh, stay tuned for some Minecraft in the very near future. Stay tuned for the DSL in the very near, near future. I cannot speak, so I'm just ending this goddamn thing. Thank you for watching. Bye bye Actually was Investigator, but still, he was lying about being healed. I'm dead! Cole! <laughs> you son of a bitch! Did Cole kill you? He killed me! I'm now the other team! I gotta win somehow! God damn it! Cole! <laughs>